Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to Project Zomboid. Let's see, I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna move out, because I don't feel like this place offers me much. Why can't I open this damn door? Hello? There we go. Okay, nice. So I went ahead and I rested for the night, and I think we're gonna head south through here, or should we head... I don't know. I guess I should have ate something. Let's see. Let's finish off our chocolate. Probably, probably not the best thing to eat first. Probably wouldn't spoil or anything like that, but I don't have much else. Just cereal. And being in a forested area, probably not the best idea, but it looks like there's a big building over here. Alright, let's check that out. I feel like we gotta do some scavenging. Find some supplies. I'm gonna need food again soon. You're a dog. <gasps> it sounds like the dog's dying. Oh my god, that is a that is a horde right there. Five zombies is way too much. All right, we gotta lose them. We gotta lose them, guys. Let's see. Wow, this is okay. This is much more like what we want to see. Okay, big house there, nice, good stuff. Going through the trees is very slow, so you kind of you can kind of lose zombies. Walking by trees and stuff like that. And you know, I saw a dang zombie climb over these fences, but I, for the life of me, cannot figure out how to do it. Which is bad, because it seems like a really easy way to get away from them. Wow, they are all over the place. This guy is really trucking up here, too. Gotta watch him. bust out our trusty Louisville here soon. Oh my god, there's so many zombies. We might have to start running, which would probably be a bad idea. Oh, look at that. Oh, jeez. It's okay. Here's a shed, though. If we can get into the shed... Oh, jeez, he whiz. Oh my god. Is this open? <gasps> I just hit it. Oh my god. <laughs> I just constantly make bad decisions in this game. <laughs> oh, it's never good. Maybe they'll go over there and check it out, though. It looks like they did. Maybe that kind of worked as a diversion. Problem is, I have no escape. Okay. That kind of that kind of worked. Planned. I planned it, guys. Oh, jeez. See, it would be nice to be able to climb over that fence. Like, like those zombies just did. There's got to be a way to do it. Let's see, I'm just kind of curious. Maybe it's E. Ah, there we go. Figured it out. It's E, in case you're playing along and you don't know how to do it. Okay, so we got... Wow, this is... This is a lot of zombies for the daytime, it seems. But we are in a much more developed neighborhood, so that's probably a good thing. Alright, let's try to do Let's kind of sneak around here and see if we can move up to one of these buildings. I would really like to go check out that, uh... Check out that big building that was back there. And also that shed. Okay. Two windows with the zombie in the back. Right, let's try this one right here. We'll go for the door first. No dice. Oh, jeez. Ah, oh, it's locked. Okay, I think when you hear that uh, kind of click noise, it means that it won't ever open. So you'd have to smash it. All right, let's let's take this hoe out. Boom. Jose Alvarez, bitch. All right, there we go. I think I kind of. Uh, Got around that zombie horde that was up in this region. Oh, gosh. Must be in a very hot climate right now, because I keep getting the overheated thing of a bobber. I think that's called a moody, if I'm not mistaken. Milk package and pizza. Nice. So, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, when you see this blue line here on an item, that means it can expire, so you probably want to eat those first. Let's see, 
cabbage. Ooh, okay. Let's go ahead and grab that. So, the plan is eventually to put our gardening skill to use in our career as a farmer. Hopefully we can... Oops. Hopefully we can find a place to settle down and make a nice little farm. Something to... with some sustainability. Can only scavenge for so long. Let's see, I guess those items I cannot pick up. I'd really like to find, like, a hammer, you know, some tools, saws. Not a lot of items in this house, either. Newspaper. Kind of like to read these whenever I find them, just briefly. They don't take long, and I figure it helps with your, your mood, things like that. So this says it's a milk package. What the hell does that mean? What? Like, when I hear package, I almost think it's, like, dried milk, you know what I'm saying? Alright, let's, let's, uh, well, we don't really need food yet. I would like to drink out of the, the water fountain, if I can. Out of the sink, I should say. Hmm. Alright, you know what we're gonna do? We're just gonna eat, like, uh, let's do a quarter of that. Ooh, expert carpentry. Again, that's level 7 to 8. And it's, it's almost a whole pound, so not ideal. I'm going to leave the door open. I think that'll be probably the probably the best way to know that I've been to a, a building before. I'm not sure that the zombies really open doors. They I know they break through windows, and I think they can break through doors, but I don't think they ever open them, so. Oh. Look at all the zombies. <laughs> this game. Man, it, it's really surprising how much how much they have on the screen at one time. I think when Roy Green died, there were at least a dozen. I mean, it was uh, it was pretty bad. Let's see, close that window up. Okay, we, we got to be ready. I'm not trusting this building. Okay, we're good. What is this package on the floor? Nothing. I felt like there should be like a chainsaw in there or something. It seems so. Kind of like just sitting randomly in the middle of the floor. Felt like there was going to be a really good item in there. It does block my movement too. I got to be careful about that. Okay, we're clear. Nothing in this house either. Wow, really struggling. I'm going to keep drinking every chance I get though. Just because we had the, uh, the unpleasantly hot moody there. And uh, makes us thirsty all the time. So keep that... Keep that uh, down as much as we can. I know that being hungry lowers your strength and also, obviously, your carry weight. So I don't know what thirst does. Obviously, you would you would die eventually, for one. Slight panic. Oh wow, there's a guy hiding in those trees. We got a church here. Bam. Nice. All right, let's check this out. I feel like there's probably not much in here. Locked. Who locks a church? Had a boy. I keep wanting to hit closed window. I don't know why. Okay. This would not be a safe place to stay. That's for sure. Okay, nothing in the church. Hmm. Don't think I would ever go in there. That's that's pretty much a death trap. I guess you could kind of go through the door and climb out a window. Oh, there's two floors there, though. Did I miss a staircase? I didn't see one, right? Yeah, okay. Kind of odd. You can clearly see that there's a second floor there. Wow, I feel like we haven't found hardly anything of use. Not good. Nice looking house over there. Of course, I don't think the house is... I don't think it really matters how nice the house is, I guess. Locked. Alright, we're gonna take this guy out. Ooh, we got one on the window, too. Okay. Oh, jeez. Okay, screw that house. <laughs> Not only do I have to fight to get 
the outside cleared, but there is one on the inside too. There's a doghouse. That's kind of nice. Can we go through the gate? Oh, okay. I feel like I never saw gates like that before. It's kind of nice. Remove propane tank. Huh. There are so many things about this game that I, quite frankly, know nothing about. So, it's constantly a learning experience. There's a zombie in there. But he's on the other side of the room, so we should be able to take him out. Relatively easily. Let's do it, baby. Let's dance. Boom. <gasps> Boom. <gasps> he's a beast. He won't go down. Oh no! Climb through the window! Jeez! We're drowsy, could do with a lie down. Oh my god. This guy's a monster. There he goes. Uh. Wow. I thought we were done. I thought I was dead already. <laughs> that was not good. That's two close calls. Counting the, the first episode. I almost died there too. Jeez. You gotta play it smart here. I gotta get I gotta get used to that. Let's go ahead and close the uh, close the curtains here. So if I can clear this out, I'll probably take a little nap. Ooh, another baseball bat. Repaired, never. Huh. Okay, so I guess you don't I guess you don't ever have to repair that. That's pretty nice. Jeez. Come on. Ugh, get away! Oh my gosh. I think what it is... Oh, shoot, I thought he was dead. Want some more? Buddy? Ooh. It's hard to see when they're right below you. Okay. Chop that wood, baby. There we go. Okay. I think what it is is the length of the weapon is... Oh, here we go. Mushroom seeds. Um, the length of the weapon is pretty key. So if you're too close with a baseball bat, it will... Not do much for you. Another dead rat, cooking pot. Whereas with like a frying pan, it probably would be better in close range, like in inside a house, I bet, because they're so much shorter. Bath towel, man. Okay, let's, let's grab the sheets. I did pull the sheets off of the prior, the building where we were at when I first started. Looks good, looks good. We're thirsty, we're drowsy, and we're, we have moderate exertion. So I think what we'll do, we'll do like a quick nap. Can we, oh, nine hours? Wow. Really wanna do, let's see, it's uh, six o'clock. I wonder if we can just do an hour. Cause here's the thing, you don't wanna, yeah, we're still drowsy, damn. If I go to sleep now, I'm gonna wake up at like three in the morning and it's, so dark that obviously there are a lot of zombies out too so that's never a good thing I try to go to bed at like at least 10 o'clock could do with a little bite to eat yeah alright so let's try experimenting with this we got some cheese we got some onions what we want to do what about a, this cooking pot I'm not entirely certain how this works and I might not be able to figure it out but let's see if we go like this I think we Put it in the container. So now it's on the stove. All right, then we can turn the stove on. All right, so what we want to do is make some food. Can we... I think normally if you click it and it will come up saying add to, I don't know, add to recipe or something like that. So I guess we can't make anything with what we have. So let's go ahead and turn the stove off. Unfortunate. Alright, let's eat some more pizza. Boy, I don't want to go out because we're drowsy. And I don't want to go to bed yet. Only 8 o'clock. Pretty rough. Let's see, let's close these. So I think what we'll do is I'm just going to I'm gonna go ahead and progress. I'll hang out in the house and uh, pick up when we wake up in the morning here. 
I was able to get nine hours of sleep in, so that's pretty awesome. I guess maybe I should wait for that uh, drowsy moody to come up more often. This is not bad. I got a full nine hours in. It's fairly light out. It's 7 o'clock. 7.20. So we should be good here. A couple zombies already at me. Let's try to hit one more building. Oh, there's that shed. Another shed over there. Alright, let's try to get over there. I'm assuming I can't climb this fence. Oh, okay. I'm wrong. I wonder if the zombies can climb it. This is interesting. It almost looks like an X is scratched into the ground there. I, that would be pretty neat if they were, if you had like a shovel and you could dig that up. Of course, it could just be sticks. Alright, let's see if... Uh, can anything... doesn't look like anything can be in a doghouse. Okay, that's locked. Hopefully this window... Oh, can I just see in there? It doesn't look like there's anything in there. Oh, damn it. Damn that thing. I wish I could flip those. Here we go. Climb through. Oh, yes. Give daddy some, some working. Ooh, a fishing rod. Okay. I don't know where there is, like, water to do any fishing. Now we're in business. Here we go. Hammer. Wire. I bet that's useful. Okie dokie. Nice. So we got... Why do I want to say... Craft spiked bat. There we go. Nails and a hammer. <laughs> okay, so we can see the damage definitely went up. It was about, I would say, 30% of the bar. Now it's almost half. It is two pounds, and I, it, now it looks like the condition will... It'll degrade. So we got to watch out for that. How's my pizza doing? Looks good. The cheese, the onion, and the avocado, I gotta watch out for, because that stuff will go bad. See, now we can build stuff. So we got wall, wooden wall, wooden pillar, log wall, doors, door frames, window frames, stairs, a bar? <laughs> that would fit in so well if I could have been an alcoholic like I wanted to be. Furniture, fence, lamp on pillar. Okay. Hmm. And then it tells you down there, you need a plank, nails, carpentry, flashlight, and rope. Okay. Good stuff. I think we're going to go ahead and call it an episode here. I'm going to eat some pizza. So our guy is uh, well fed. Let's go ahead and finish it off. And now that I think about it, I wonder, because that didn't look like, oddly, it didn't look like the pizza would go bad. So maybe I should have eaten like the avocado and stuff like that. Oh, look, a broken window on this house. So we're going to go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and open this and uh, get some water because we're thirsty. Once we Damn it. Every time I do that. And we'll start the next episode here, checking out this building and then probably continuing our search heading south. Looks like there's something funky down here in the bottom left corner. So we'll check that out next episode. Thanks for watching, guys. Leave me a comment. I will see you in the next one.